Harry, commiserations. The, the manager just, just just said the, the players couldn't have given much more. Is that the way you feel about it? Um, yeah, I think uh, I'm really proud of the lads. Um, listen, we've given everything. This is tournament football and, and big moments, win, win big matches. I feel like we're the better team throughout the night. We've controlled the game from minute one. They scored um, from 30 yards the first goal and um, a big moment. Uh, they were clinical in the second goal. So, listen, we had a lot of chances. We dominated a lot of the ball. I think you can see over the four or five year period now that we belong in these big games. Um, and I think the lads are going to be hurt, they're going to be disappointed, but I really believe that this country's turn, turned a corner now and, and, and we belong on this stage, we belong in these later stages of these knockout tournaments. Um, and I think if we can take anything from the game, I think our performance shows that. It will feel like, I imagine, though, a huge missed chance for this group because you've gone toe-to-toe -to -toe with the world champions. Well, listen, we... I'm not going to stand here and say it was going to be a tough night because we fully believe that we'd win the game. We had great belief within our dressing room that we would we'd win the tournament and that's not arrogant. I felt like we, we was playing well, we'd come good at the right moment, uh, we was defending well, um, we were starting to control games, what we haven't done in the past and having a lot more possession of the, than the opposition as we have done again tonight. Um, so we had great belief that we, we we had a great opportunity to win the tournament, so it hurts, it really does hurt. Um, one thing I'd say is that I feel like this, these players will get another opportunity at playing on this big stage in these big knockout games because it's a talented squad, it has some, it has some amazing players. Um, and we'll learn from it and we'll move on. On a night when you've got two penalties, what did you think of the referee's overall performance? I can't really explain his performance really, the amount of decisions he got wrong was, was actually incredible, so really poor. And what about Gareth? Do you hope Gareth stays? He says he's going to review it. What do, you, what do the players think and what do they hope? The, the players love Gareth. Um, from 1 to 11 the players absolutely love Gareth. He's been amazing with each and every one of us, his man management skills. Um, the way he sets us up, I know a lot of people have different views because he's the England manager and, and when he picks a squad there's always uh, players who shouldn't be there and players who, who need to be there and then when he picks his starting 11 again he, he gets a lot of sticks so that's the, that's the, the, the privileges of being a, uh, an England manager but I think you can see how far this, how far this team's come over his period of management, um, he knows what it takes to, to win these big matches. And I think, like I said, the, the performance we was there, we did, we, you can only look after the performance. When you go into football matches, you've got to look after the performance and the performance was there and unfortunately, maybe that little bit of clinical, we wasn't there tonight. Thank you, Harry. Thank Appreciate you. it. Well,